All right, I'm going to show you how to sight in a rifle with two shots. Okay, sight in your uh, thermal vision or any kind of scope really on your rifle. Here's the way to do it. First off, you want to make sure that it's mounted properly. Make sure that your bases are tight. Everything is tight, snug, and secure. Okay, I like to use it. I like to get on a bench where I've got a nice, stable foundation to shoot from. This particular rifle is a 308. And like I said, it's got a thermal unit on it. This is made by Armasite. What I like to do is, you'll notice on the target, I have a small piece of tin foil. And the reason for that is because this is a thermal unit, it will not show detail of just the cardboard backstop. I've got to have that piece of, of uh, tin foil on there so I can actually see the crosshairs on the target. Now I've got the thermal set up where it is on white hot. And you can see that piece of tin foil very easily. You can see the crosshairs through there. But this works, like I said, whether you're using a, a, a thermal vision scope like this or whether you're using just a standard rifle scope. So what we're going to do, once everything is on good and snug, what we're going to do, we're going to get a nice, good, solid rest. And we're going to squeeze off around. And you'll notice the whole rest of the target is clean. And that way I need to be able to watch and see where I hit. It's real important to make sure where you hit this very first shot. Let's go ahead and take it. All right, this is real important. At this point, we're gonna go down and we're gonna mark that bullet hole with a piece of tinfoil. All right, you wouldn't have to do this if you're using a standard rifle scope, but using thermal, this is necessary because you cannot see the bullet hole without it. So what we're gonna do is we're going to staple a piece of tinfoil right over the bullet hole. And here's the tricky part coming up. Okay, here is the tricky part. Pay attention if you want to be able to shoot and sight in with two cartridges. Okay, it works whether you're shooting a standard scope or a thermal scope. Make sure and have a nice uh, a rest for your gun where I can, I mean, it just stays nice and still, as you can see. Okay, and what I'm going to do here, I want to line up on the target, and I'm going to go into my menu. Once I go into the menu, I'm going to go to the point where I can adjust my reticle. in the bore sight section of the menu. Now, you'll notice the crosshairs. What I'm gonna do is I'm going to stabilize the rifle on the table, and then I'm going to adjust the reticle to move it. See it moving like that? Move it to where it is in line with where I shot originally. Now I'm gonna take the other line and I'm going to move it to where it is directly centered over the first impact shot. That ought to be it right there. Okay, so all I've wound up doing, the gun is going to shoot the exact same spot every single time. All I've done is adjust the reticle to hit where the first shot was. That's all I was doing. And now what we're going to do, we're going to load it. We're gonna take a shot and see what happens. Absolutely perfect. That's the way you sight in a rifle with only two shots. I'm Keith Warren, I hope this tip helped you. And if you liked it, make sure and subscribe to our channel.